Hey guys, welcome back to True Life Reviews. Hey, how's everybody doing today? <laughs> She's just going to sit there and be like, yep, yep, yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, today we're actually going to do my nails for Nail Saturday. And we're doing the Sensational Polish to Gel Transformer. So what it is, is this little packet is the refill because if you already have a light, you don't need the big packet. Just the refill, $9.99. And you can pick any kind of gel you want, gel, blah, any kind of nail polish you want. It does not have to be a gel nail polish. So, you know, we're going to go through the steps of how to do this, but I'm hoping it's really cool. And we also get to remove the gel nail polish off from Grandma's nails. Yeah, you can see that. It, it didn't last as long as we had hoped. It's pretty bad the Impress nails <laughs> lasted mm. longer than the gel. But, it, I mean, most of it stayed on. So, do you want to do yours first, or do, what do you want to do? Because mine, I mean, you can have yours sitting and waiting. Right. Yeah. So, basically, you can get some aluminum foil, and preferably use uh, cotton balls, but I forgot cotton balls, so we're going to use some toilet paper. And you need some acetone. And what you have to do is basically, kind of self-explanatory, Stick the acetone on a cotton ball, stick it on top of your nail, wrap it up in aluminum foil, and wait 15 minutes. So we're going to go ahead and do one of them on camera, and then the rest I'm going to do off camera, just because it's going to take forever, and we don't want to bore you to death. So. <laughs> <laughs> we're supposed to be fun and lively, not boring. Yep. I'm sure we have boring moments, though. Dun, dun, oh, dun. I just got acetone on my nail. Ah, the birds! The birds! So I got it, like, really good on there. Wrap it on the nail. Take this. And I'm just gonna make her look like a robot. Look at that. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Once we're finally done, she's gonna look like Edward. Edward... Scissor aluminum hands. Pan, ha, aluminum pants. <laughs> <laughs> aluminum hands. <laughs> aluminum pants. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> oh, my Lord. No. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and get the rest of her fingers done. Okay. So I got all of her hands done. She. I am going <laughs> now. <laughs> <laughs> they do have um, a thing where it's just a clip that you can put on that has it sit on there. But, you know. This is cheaper, and you have a lot more. I mean, a dollar for aluminum foil, and you have, like, a whole bunch of times you can do it. Um, but you can get it from Wish for a dollar, and then I think it's a dollar shipping, or Amazon, but you're going to pay a lot more for Amazon. But with Wish, you're going to wait a long time. So get to know this method until you have them come in. All right, so Grandma's web box is all done. We just got to wait 15 minutes. So I decided to go with this nail polish. And we gotta open this up and see what we got. Here's like a little thing to pour it into. There's two different ways you can do it. Um, you can either mix them all together in the little pot or put this on first, then put this on, then cure it. Um, whatever method you think is best for you. Here's our little instructions and the polish. I mean, that's all you get. This, this, and the instructions. <laughs> So I'm gonna read over the instructions real quick. And there's all different kinds of little things. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> all right, so I'm going to do the one where you put the nail polish on your nail first, for sure. And it's really easy. Just apply your nail polish like you normally would, one to two coats. Then you're going to apply the gel transformer on there and then cure your nails. Bam, you're done. So we're gonna go ahead and look at getting this done. My nails are totally crud still. I hate that glue stuff. So you just apply two coats. So this might take me a little while. Heal. All right. So whoop. you don't want to apply too much because then it's going to take forever to dry. So I'm going to get the rest of my nails done. All right. So I think they're pretty much good and dry. So then the next step is just to um, lightly, well, not really lightly, but you know what I mean. Just apply a thin coat of gel. 
onto your fingers. Da -da -da. So I'm just gonna do a thin coat onto my nails. And then all you do is cure it. And bam, you have turned your regular nail polish into gel nail polish. And then this will last two weeks just as normal gel would. Yeah, at least that's what it says. We'll find out. Yep. Yeah. Right. Also, I'm, so I'm gonna do in one the process of ordering some magnetic tools that will... Dun dun dun. Ooh, it feels warm under here. This is my first time using it. Take and make the gels in different patterns. That's the 15. Do it one more time. And then that makes it 30. Da da da. Da da da. It's warm. Mm hmm. I didn't know that. Alright, so now I'm going to do my thumb if I can get my thumb in there. <laughs> Things a little. So. Ow, it's burning. That wasn't nice. What? My finger was burning. <laughs> like really, it was hot. It felt like it was burning off. I've, I've heard in a lot of other things say that there is that feeling like it's burning. So. I guess that's a normal thing, the torture we put ourselves through, I swear. All right, it feels like it's done. Maybe not. <laughs> Let's do it again. <laughs> <laughs> this might take a minute, but you can just heal. So I'm going to go ahead and get all these cured, and then we will show the final, you know, product. Okay, so I got my nails all cured. And I kept curing it and curing it and I forgot that this will leave like a sticky residue feeling. So you need to get like a little wipe and wipe it down. I cannot believe I forgot that step. So I'm just wiping off the sticky part of the gel. And you see that some of my nails are messed up because I had to stop and Take care of Maddie's dap also. <laughs> I kind of messed them up a little bit, but that's okay. It seems to work really well. I'm kind of actually surprised. I didn't think it was working, and then I was like, oh yeah, it's going to have a sticky residue feeling to it. Because at the end, you're supposed to wipe it with a lint wipe to get that feeling. Yeah, see now it's not, it doesn't feel sticky at all. You just got to make sure you get it all off. Huh. Durr. <laughs> I feel so smart. <coughs> so now I have <coughs> gel nails using just my regular nail polish. Wow! Very pretty color. Yeah. All right, so now it's Grandma Toy Box's turn because I'm pretty sure it's been over 15 minutes. All right, so this part, um, I don't know how well it's going to work, but let's see. We're going to try on her thumb just to see if we can get this stuff to come off here. And then you can use like a little tool and it's supposed to like, ooh, this stuff's really on there. Yeah, see, is that hurting? No. It's supposed to come off really easily, but it may not. You might have to soak your whole hand. Because this is not, it's supposed to like just, and done. But, oh, I don't want to mess up mine though. <laughs> Maybe we should, really should have done this one at a time here. Because it's supposed to like come right up. And I don't want to hurt your nail either. So we may need to find a different method for taking these off. Because this is not working. Let me see if just wiping it. I'm trying to keep my my nails safe here. 
<laughs> That's not working really either. <gasps> Look at that. That's that's some good gel. <laughs> the black is like barely coming off. So, hmm. Maybe we need to soak them. Stick your hands in little things and soak them in there. Because it, it may not be getting a direct contact because we're not using um, cotton swabs. So let's try that method instead and see how that goes. <laughs> All right, so it looks like the dipping it in acetone worked so much better. You want to go ahead and just show real quick? Yeah, so whoop. dipping it in acetone, it's like getting a lot better as far as getting it off. But we will research other ways to do it because she's having to like scratch the crud out of her nail. <laughs> so we know how to get it on. We just need to figure out how to get it off. <laughs> Without destroying yeah. the nail. Yeah, right? <laughs> Would be nice. Right? Exactly. They do have protector pads in here. and we, Maybe we should have thought about using that, but you know. But that is it for Nail Saturday. It looks like the gel to nail kit does work really well. So if you have a nail polish that's your favorite and it's not a gel, but yeah, you want gel nails, there's your route. Just saying. All right. Well, we will see you guys <laughs> for Mystery Monday. Oh, I almost forgot. Um, we were going to announce the new schedule. For the new schedule, we are going to do videos on Monday. What was it? Ugh. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. Okay, so those are our new videos that are coming out. Monday is going to be, of course, Mystery Monday. Wednesday is going to be our special needs day. Um, Friday, of course, is our LOL day. And then Saturday, Nail Day. Um, and then on Tuesday, Thursday, trying to think, Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, those are going to be the days where we're going to interact with you guys, talk to you on Instagram, on our YouTube uh, channel. You know, that way we can get some better interaction going because it's been so crazy and videos haven't been going up as fast as we'd like. We have a whole bunch of videos, but we're not getting them up. <laughs> um, and that way, you know, you guys know that we are looking at our, you know, our comments and everything. So... Just a just a little heads up that we have a schedule now. Woop woop. All right, well we'll see you guys later. Bye. Goodbye.